Okay, so I have a roll of aluminum foil here, and I cut a piece off, and um, let's uh, take our radio and uh, stick it inside the aluminum foil. And as you can hear, it's no longer making any radio noise because it can't receive radio waves. And I'll put it next to our uh, scalar wave generator here. And let's see if the scalar waves penetrate the, uh, the foil. Okay, I turn on the frequency generator. As you can hear, the radio is still picking up the scalar wave transmissions. Even though it can't pick up any radio signals. Very cool, huh? So the scalar waves are generated by this thing. They penetrate the aluminum foil and the radio can pick them up. So, proof that our scalar wave generator is in fact working. And again, you could hear the radio signal that it was picking up from the noise and the background and the weak radio station disappeared when I put the aluminum foil around it. Let's take this thing back off out of the aluminum foil. And uh, magic, this is what they call the prestige, right? Make sure that our radio is still working. As soon as I take it out, the radio signals back. So this aluminum foil does oh, effectively uh, shield the radio waves. And our scalar wave generator produces a field that goes through our Faraday cage here and produces interference on our little transistor radio. Very cool, huh? Let's turn this thing back on. Okay. So we get a better shot of that. There we go. So there is our scalar wave generator and our radio. And uh, the demonstrated scalar waves penetrating a Faraday cage. Okay, anyway, this is uh, Dr. James, and thanks for watching.